Well, once a year in Cross Lake, boaters and boating enthusiasts gather for the annual Whitefish Chain and Antique and Classic Wood Boat Rendezvous. Justin Prince has more in this week's Community Spotlight. It all started in 1988 with a mere 10 boats and an idea. The show started 28 years ago with about 10 people over at Manhattan Beach showing off their wood boats and it's slowly grown. Now 28 years later, it's grown into a day-long spectacle with over 50 antique wooden boats. They actually planned the very first of these shows at the end of my dock, I think is where the genesis happened. The guy that started it and my uncle and a few others were kind of, we should get together and show off these boats. And the very next year they did. That was 28 years ago, and we're still going strong. They got over 50 boats today. It's nostalgia. Everybody loves to see the old boats that their grandpa had or their dad had or somebody before their time. And they're beautiful boats, very well taken care of. And after 28 years, both boaters and enthusiasts alike say it's all about tradition. My father was a Larson boat collector, and uh, he passed that on to me. So we've been collecting Larson boats for many, many years. It is a way to reconnect with my father, who was, you know, a boat collector, and, and uh, Larson boats specifically. And uh, it's just fun to keep that tradition up with, uh, you know, since he had such great enjoyment with the boats. But I love the people. You get to see them every year, and it's almost enough time has gone by that it's like a family. So you don't see them any other time of the year except here at Moonlight Bay and it will all get together. It's a family reunion. And although the boat show is all about something old, there's something new every single year. This is something where you come every year, if you want, and there's always something new to see. Something old, yet new to see, every year. The show has been only open to wooden boats for the past 28 years but they are considering adding a fiberglass division to keep building the show's popularity. For this week's Community Spotlight, Justin Prince, Lakeland News. And next year's Boat Rendezvous is already set for June 18th in 2016. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.